I mean, if you'd like to... Shower bubbles from Tub and Shower. It comes with bubble solution. You put it together. Dolls and batteries not included. Weekday mornings are cool. Bodie is crazy. Garfield is lazy. He loves to take naps all day long. <sighs> Bugs and his friends are nuts to the end. They'll start off your day with a song. <laughs> Who knows where he's at? That really cool cat. He's your favorite panther in pink. <laughs> She's up with the styles and spreads lots of smiles. She's Shusha, the girl with the wink. So when you wake up to watch TV, which cartoons would you rather see? Catch Garfield, Mary Melodies, The Pink Panther, and Shusha. Every weekday morning on Fox 53. Watch it. The shape of bugles? A dazzling sight. But the taste of bugles? Lip smacking delight. Bugles, it's the taste that's a blast. If I am what I eat, I'd like to be a Nature Valley granola bar. Basic, wholesome, and always totally irresistible. Then people everywhere could think of me as the candy bar nature intended. The excitement's building. Bargain hunters from everywhere are coming to the biggest furniture sale of the year. The 36-hour marathon sale at Value City Furniture. Starting tomorrow at 9 a.m., every item and every jam-packed aisle has been marked down to the lowest sale prices of the season. Living rooms, bedrooms, dining rooms, dinettes, entertainment centers, curios, recliners, desk tables, and more. Two-way recliner, $98. White day bid, $59. Halogen floor lamp, $18.88. Terms to fit everyone's budget. Come prepared to buy. Starting tomorrow at 9 a.m., the 36-hour marathon sale at Value City Furniture. I'm back. What could possibly go wrong? Okie dokie, Arnold. Time to rise and shine, old pal of mine. Get in the truck. Let the ten for the butt down. <laughs> Come on, Arnold, old buddy. Wake up. <sighs> oh, 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 the truck. The truck is back. Come on, snap to him, Mr. Basket Case. It's me, the Prince of Personality, Bubsy. Bubsy? Oh, oh, worse than a truck. Oh, come on. You know I'm your hero. You're not. Well, of course I am. I'm your hero, and you're my sidekick. No! Oh, please. Do we have to go through this every single morning? No, I don't want to be your sidekick. What's that? Relax. It's just the twins. They're going to celebrate their birthday with their Uncle Bubsy. Oh, oh, not the twins! I mean, I mean. All right. Hide under the couch. All right, all right, I'm coming. Hey, Uncle Bouncy! Where's Arnold? Under the couch. I couldn't resist. Arnold! Oh, oh, no, no! Oh. I don't want to play with me! No, he wants to play with me! He's mine! No, mine! Mine, mine! And last year, over 10,000 armadillos were run over by trucks in the state of Texas alone. For many of the poor little fellows, this is the last sound they will ever hear. Oh, oh, the truck! Oh, I mean, I... Oh, look! Arnold wants to play ball! Okay, Arnold, you're the ball! Be careful, Arnold. Don't play too rough with the twins. Oh, oh, oh. Hey, Terry, go long! <laughs> She's gone! Next, we'll be interviewing Virgil Reality, the inventor of an incredible new helmet that can turn your imagination into reality. I like it. This 
adventure. If used responsibly, could someday stop war and famine <laughs> and eventually save the entire planet. So far, it's mostly blown up on Virgil's head. All I need now is someone extremely uh, brave to test the helmet. You said you needed someone totally not. Hey, that's me. I'm totally not. Yo, Arnold, guess what? <laughs> what? I, Bubsy, am going to be the one to test that still dangerous yet unbelievably potential-filled virtual reality helmet <laughs> that could someday save the world. Why do you want to test it, Uncle Bubsy? Why? I'll tell you why. <laughs> because I am brave. <clears throat> because I crave adventure. <laughs> Because I'm a hero for crying out loud. And if that's a crime, then book me. Yay, Bubsy, yay! Hey, what could possibly go wrong? I distinctly heard you say nuts. No, I said brave. Not. Brave. Oh, if I could get my paws on that helmet, I could finally live the lifestyle that I deserve. Buzz! Sid, come hit at once! A uh, present. I killed... Oh, oh, sorry. That boy, oops. What took you two so long? Well, uh, I was making a nice bouillabaisse, you see, and I was just about to add the coriander when Sid here just had to stick his big fat tongue in the pot. Hot, 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 hot. It was a rhetorical question! It's just that you're such a sophisticated and, and subtle person. It's hard for Sid and I to tell sometimes whether you're angry or, or not angry. Do you see, we're, we're in a terrible quandary at times with things. No, no, not the blackboard! <laughs> Now that I have your attention, I have a job for you to do. I want you to pay a visit to a Mr. Virgil reality. Oh, oh, oh. Hungry, hungry. Apparently, he's created a helmet that could make me the richest and most powerful creature in the universe. Come here, Mr. Paz. Come here. Now, as you know, I've clawed my way to the top to become the classiest kitten in this whole catatonic town. But I deserve more, much more. I deserve it all! Yes, yes, darling, of course you do. Ooh, ooh, food. Come on, the boss. Do we perhaps have something in our mouth? <laughs> I didn't think so. Fine. Oh, nuts. Okay, Virgil. Hello. Bugsy Bobcat here. I called about casting the helmet. Oh, yeah, good. Virgil's expecting you, Bucky. Let's Bugsy. Okay. Welcome. I am Virgil Reality, and you must be Bootsy. It's Spunky. Bubsy. Oh, yeah. It does not matter what your name is. The only requirement for testing the Virgil Reality helmet is bravery. He means you have to be totally nuts. Well, hey, I can handle it on both counts, guys. <laughs> so, how does this puppy work? Well, you just think of whatever you want and blink two times with your eyes. This will cause the electromagnetic impulses of your cerebral cortex to trans... Yaddy, 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 yaddy. Save it, Copernicus. Cut to the chase. I'm ready for the gusto. Let's power up, babe. Oh, oh, boy. I'll think of something that really blows my hair back because I want to fly. <laughs> What now, I guess? Give me I'll take it. Oh, 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 oh. Uh, oh, no. Arnold, Arnold, whatever you do, don't think of the truck. The truck! The truck! The truck! Do something, Bobby! Bobby! Whatever! What the You made my rats come back. Virgil, Virgilio, Virgil Mundo, you gotta lighten up, babe. Loosen the suspenders a little. In fact, you gotta lose your suspenders altogether. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Uncle Bubsy, we're bored. Yeah, can we play with the helmet now? Absolutely not. The helmet is not a toy. Yeah, I knew that. The helmet is not a toy. <laughs> Besides, it's just for Virgil and me to play with. <laughs> Right, Verge, old buddy? <laughs> <laughs> Bugs, you'll be right back. Oh. He's been dead 100 million years. But then... You woke him up. 
Tyrannosaurus Rex. You take turns putting on his bones, but be careful. One false move brings him to life and puts you out of the game. Tyrannosaurus Rex, the game that's so scary, it's fun. Bumble around with the bumble ball, baby. Bumble, bumble, bumble around. Say a little ball and it don't mean maybe. Make you laugh when you pick it up or put it down. Everybody loves trying to get a handle on the bumble ball. If gentle, wacky bumbling motion keeps you busy or puts you in a tizzy. Are we having a ball or just losing our grip? Who cares? Bumble around with the bumble ball, baby. It's the wackiest ball in town. The bumble ball turtle. Hi, I'm Tom Barrasso of the Pittsburgh Penguins, along with GW, one of this year's Make-A-Wish kids. You can help make GW's wish come true, along with many other deserving kids. Donate $20 to the Make-A-Wish Foundation, and the folks at Quintex will give you a transportable or handheld cellular phone at no charge. Quintex, an authorized Bell Atlantic mobile agent, wants to help the kids. They'll give you a cellular phone if you donate $20 to Make-A-Wish. Quintex, Bell Atlantic Mobile, the Pens, and Make-A-Wish, working together for kids. You need a job. You need a future. Your career as a trained respiratory therapist can begin now. Trained respiratory therapists are in demand. Today is your chance for a great opportunity. Great training, great career, great future. Western School of Health and Business, 281-2600. It's a great time to call, 281-2600. Western School of Health and Business, Pittsburgh campus, Monroeville campus, 281-2600, 281-2600. We'll take your mind off it. Think of something pleasant. Ha. Oh, okay. Uh, uh, food, food. Ooh, hungry, hungry. Ooh, nice, buddy. Can you find it? Come, come here. You're always hungry. Well, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm a shrew. If, if I don't eat every ten minutes, I go mad. Yes, well, in your case, I say it's a little too late. I know. Huh? What luck! This couldn't be more perfect. My turn! My turn! My turn! Oh, my turn. Yeah. So now, if we play our cards correctly, you and I will get dinner for two, and Allie will get her helmet. <laughs> huh? Now get ready. We're going to dive bomb them. Yeah, but... My turn, my turn. I win a pony. <laughs> okay, now me. I want a dual overhead cam fuel and chicken power bowl. <laughs> All right. Oh, my food. Now, let's see. Bunnies, bears. Ah, recipes for bobcat. Ah, bobcat a poivre with peppercorn. Oh, that's good. Ow! Naughty, naughty. You know, that was a very nasty thing you did to my idiotic accomplice. However, turn over the helmet so I can make you into a nice souffle. Wow, wow. Watch cake go boom, boom. Oh, boy! Let's play with the rat and the turkey. I am not a turkey. I'm a buzzard. I'm a majestic bird of prey. Okay, so, turkey, you want to go on a roller coaster with us? There is no roller coaster. You want to bet? <laughs> Please, Oblivia. Excuse me, Mr. Bumpy, but the helmet is kind of, you know, gone. Whoops. The twins must have it. Hey, we gotta try and get it back before they destroy the world, or worse! Ah! Oh, I gotta lay off those breakfast burritos. Oh. What in the world is... Ah. Oh, oh! Hey, 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 calm down, Arnold. What could possibly go wrong? My helmet has been stolen! The entire world can be destroyed in the blink of an eye! Virgil, Virgil, always looking at the downside! Come on, Arnold, uh, let's be heroes and uh, save the day! Uh, oh, 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 let's do it, Arnold! Let's take the bull by the horns! Let's throw caution to the wind! It's time to be heroes, for crying out loud! I mean, what 
what could possibly go wrong? Everything! to the turkey and the rat, you could have easily destroyed the world. But it's our birthday! Ah, <laughs> <laughs> oh, scared, scared. The place scared of heights, but too high. Oh, shut up and listen to the plan, you ninny. Now then, I'm going to zero in on the little beasts, judge the proper trajectory and velocity, and release you like a bomb. A buzz bomb, if you will. Ooh, ooh, bad plan. Not good. Bad plan. You'll catch them totally by surprise and snatch the helmet. Good luck. Yeah, but... Good luck. Bad plan. Bad plan. <laughs> what do you know? A flying rat. Well, Sidney, I see you finally have the helmet. I'm going to make you a deal that's based on the hunch. The hunch being that you have a very, very small brain. Did you say something? I'll trade you the stale corn dog for the helmet. Definitely food. Food is good. Helmet. What helmet? Thank you. If I'm not a king, where's the helmet? You didn't trade it for food, did you, Sid? <laughs> then what's that hanging out of your disgusting little mouth? Um, a fuse? Well, I did it. I saved the entire planet. And now, what could possibly go wrong? What could possibly go wrong? What could possibly go wrong? Yeah, success! Yeah. At last, Virgil Reality's helmet is all mine. Now I'll make myself rich beyond my wildest dreams. I'll start by wishing for a 50-carat ruby ring. <laughs> well, Allie, uh, if you'll excuse us, we have some uh, cooking to do. Oh, oh, yeah, cooking is good, yeah. We can make great mud pies. Yes, but you'll make it even better, Cacciatore. Fox 
53's Kids Club Game Show answer and win. What do you win? Big prizes and cash from Mom and Dad. How do you win? Just answer the Kids Club question each weekday morning at 8.15 by calling the answer and win hotline with the correct answer. Just dial 333-KIDS. You can win the new Milton Bradley game, It From The Pit. The first one of the treasure wins. Or Bubsy, the new video game by Alkalade for Sega Genesis, Bubsy. Every winner receives $100 cash to give to Mom and Dad. Answer and win. Weekday mornings on Fox 53. This is the time of the year for holiday parties, family gatherings, reunions, and many times drinking. Please don't ruin your celebration or someone else's by drinking and driving. I'm attorney Edgar Snyder. In my law practice, many of the victims we represent were hurt or killed as a result of someone having too much to drink. This holiday season, don't become a statistic. Play it safe. If you're going to drink, please don't drive. Have a happy holiday. Meet Andrew and Woody. Andrew has spina bifida, and he's learning to live with his disability as he grows. Yet there are many hurts he cannot be protected from. Like the time Andrew was left alone in his sandbox when his friends decided to play elsewhere. Now Woody never leaves Andrew's side. Woody is Andrew's paws with a cause service dog. Woody helps Andrew pick up dropped items and opens doors that may otherwise be closed. Paws with a cause is helping Andrew and Woody prove that disability does not mean inability. Get a grip on yourself! Bubsy is back! What went wrong? I lost the twins and the helmets, and worse than that, I was outsmarted by a turkey and a rat! Technically speaking, you were outsmarted by a shrew and a buzzard, but either way, you've sentenced the universe to certain annihilation. Thanks for the pep talk, birds! <laughs> the truck fell from the sky! <laughs> Get a grip, Arnie. I'm busy berating myself. I'm a catastrophic, cataclysmic, fool cat. Ah, hey, stop there. Oh, sorry, Arnold. I thought you were a wrench. I know. You know what I'm saying, Arnie? I know you still believe in me. I'm going to go back out there, and I'm not coming back without the twins and the helmet. Here, Bubsy. You can use my patented virtual reality helmet tracking device. Yeah, it almost oh. never blows up. Thanks, guys, but no thanks. I'll just look up the turkey and the rat in the phone book instead. Okay, let's see here. Last name, Rat. Shrew. He's a shrew. I knew that. I was just testing you. <laughs> Come back here. Oh, I hate having to play with my food. Oh, hello, Sid here. Hello, Sid. This is Bubsy Bobcat, president and owner of Bubsy's Catering Service. Now, because of your incredibly small brain, you have been chosen to receive a free banquet dinner for 50. Oh, oh my food, food, comestibles, edibles, whoa! Yeah, I'll bring you all the food right now. Just give me your address. Uh-huh. Yeah. Uh, okay. Thank you very much. Your brain is indeed very, very small. Did you just give that bobcat our address? Oh. You did! Oh, you moronic! <laughs> Helmet is making me angry. Just look at what it's done to my hair. Oh, Alan, oh, yeah. darling, I know how important your hair is to you, but I fear I have some even more troublesome news. What could be more troublesome than helmet hair? Well, Sid here told that idiot bobcat the location of your lair. He what? Apparently, he called on the phone. Uh. Idiots! I'm surrounded by idiots. When the bobcat shows up, we simply refuse to answer the door. Hello. Bubsy's catering service here for a Mr. Sid, the vicious shrew. Oh, that's me. That's me. All right, turkey. All right, rat. The game is over. The jig is up. Now, hand that helmet over before I'm forced to humble you. I don't think so. Oh. <laughs> so, you think you're cute, huh? I am both attractive and intelligent. <laughs> Do something, Sid. Use your imagination, such as it is. Um, uh, corn dog. No, no, no. Corn dog with a B. Oh, no, wait. Corn dog with a B. And a boy. Now, give me that. Go for it, Terry. On second thought, don't go for it, Terry. Happy birthday. Definitely. Happy Just birthday. Ride. Come 
Damn it! How much? <laughs> now you're all in hot water. <laughs> Why, you ungrateful turkey! That's buzzard! Huh? Oh, no. no. Oh! Not the truck again. Oh! 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 Where is it? I'll get it! I'll get it! Oh, definitely. Uh -oh. my own TV show. This week on Life's Toils of the Rich and Furry, we travel to beautiful Las Vegas. Naughty night spot of the classy Ella Cassandra. Oh. I'll take that. Yay, Uncle Bubsy! Thank you, thank you. Do something, Betsy. Hey, come here, would you? That would be Bubsy! And of course I will. Oh, oh, what's that? It's a neutron overload in the central core of the... A what? I'll tell you what it means. It means the helmet's gonna blow up on your head. Take it off. It's too dangerous. Not for me. I'm totally nuts, remember? Uh -huh. Now, I'm gonna imagine something so mind-numbingly incredible that it will instantly save the day. Yes? No? Yes. Yes? Oh, yes. I What a rush! I think I saw Elvis. Oh, Bubsy, you did it! You saved the world as we know it! Well, of course I did, babe. I'm a hero for crying out loud. And thank you for getting my name right. I did? Well, Arnie, old pal, oh. it just goes to show you. You gotta live on the edge. You gotta go for the gusto. You gotta be a hero for yeah. crying out I don't know about you, Arnold, but the thought of our next adventure already has me tingling with excitement. No, I think the helmet's shorted out. You're probably just being electrocuted. I knew that. I was just testing you, babe. Besides, what could possibly go wrong? Oh. I don't...